Poverty is the end of sleepers. Sleepers always end as sleepers. On the floor. Sleep. Sleep is a practice of death. So if you give yourself to sleep beyond measure, you are dying without knowing. You are dying. Your destiny is dying when you sleep beyond measure. Don't sleep for leisure. Sleep for rest. Now, the human body is made from the ground. So it's natural for men to want to lie down. Any small thing, I want to lie down. Where he is created from is calling for him. I want to lie down. So as a young person, no! I want to stand up. Poverty is the end of sleepers. Sleepers always end as sleepers. On the floor. Yet a little sleep, a little slumber. So shall your poverty come. So, sleep is synonymous to poverty. You can never prosper as a sleeper. Your eyes have to be opened to see opportunities. Life is slippery for sleepers. Now, very simple illustration here. When you are sleepy with your eyes, your hand will come slippery. You see Byro dropping from your hand. That's how life slips out of people's hand who sleep with their eyes. So wake up! Wake up! Opportunities are passing by. Grab it with your hand. Only those whose eyes are open can catch. Now, once your eyes closes, everything in your body becomes docile. They raise your hand. They carry your leg. Why? The eyes are asleep. The way of sleep. The way of sleep. Only Jesus has a second coming. All of us is only one coming. You miss it, you miss it. Since you don't have a spare life, why don't you make the most of this one? It's redeeming the time because the days are evil. Time! They call it lifetime. That is what your time was worth while you lived. You know why I don't sleep on time? You sleep eight hours. That's one third of your life. So when you are 75, you have slept for 25 years. <laughs> you are unconscious. 